My mother had a saying, Kamala, you may be the first to do many things, but make sure you're not the last. Kamala Harris. I felt a real sense of hope. Kamala Harris elected as the first female vice president of the United States. A real role model on so many different levels, gender, race, upbringing. My teacher Marissa Peer told us that people's issues could be summed up into three main categories. I'm not enough, I don't belong, and what I want is not available to me. I've come across cases of the what I want is not available to me when people could not see it as being possible as they've not seen it before. For example, a loving relationship, a job they loved that paid well, a woman at senior levels in their industry and more. Imagine a little girl growing up today, seeing women at the helm of countries, seeing women go into space, seeing women run highly successful businesses. In her mind, anything is possible. There are no limits, only limits you create yourself. Not only is this for little girls, this is for everyone. Like Roger Bannister broke the four minute mile, it opened the possibility for others. It made the impossible possible. Kamala Harris has a long journey ahead and a lot of work to do. She's in the right place to do it, starting with being the first of many. I'd like to include like a little footnote from someone who went into space. I never went into physics or the astronaut corps to become a role model. But after my first flight, it became clear to me that I was one. And I began to understand the importance of that to people. Young girls need to see role models in whatever careers that they may choose, just so they can picture themselves doing those jobs someday. You can't be what you can't see. That was from Sally Ride, the first American woman in space, and the source was from The Female Elite.